are you doing these maniacs? I'm crushing plastic out here for you and today I'm gonna give you a quick review of two new active line discs the Rockstar which is very close to an essence in my opinion as you will soon see and the astronaut which really is so flippy that I haven't really encountered anything else like that in the Discmania lineup Start with the Rockstar, so like I said, it's very closely shaped to like an essence. I would say the uh, extreme edge is more rounded than on the essence, and it's got a big pop top. The essence has got a pretty good sized dome, also, but uh, this takes the cake. So the numbers are almost the same. This has only five glide. Well, I say only because it's quite a lot though, but the essence has so much glide that. Nothing really beats it, in my opinion. And I feel like the particular essence that I throw, it's a little bit more flippy than this one. So, I don't know. I think I'll probably stick with that essence, but we'll see. So the astronaut, I think this is very true to its numbers. So turn of four, very often discs that are fast and turn of four, they don't really exhibit that turn for medium throwers like myself, but even throw that, I don't throw much over 100 meters. I have to put this on pretty hefty hyzer to make it fly and don't go into a roller. So uh, for me, Feels like this would be a very good distance disc for beginners, but for me it seems pretty uncontrollable so that I wouldn't have trust in it in many situations. But I'm sure it will help people reach new distances that they haven't reached before. Today is also a little bit uh, gusty and swirly, the wind is going, doing crazy stuff in all directions, so uh, I don't know, maybe on a tailwind shot or on a calmer day uh, things could have been different but for now that's my quick review of the astronaut so these two discs will be released on Tuesday the 25th so be on the lookout to score new Discmania goodies